It's the final few seconds before the lights go out and the race to the podium begins. You know this battle will be won off the track as well as on it. You've studied your tactics, anticipated every move like a grand master. You've researched and analyzed, modified and fine-tuned to perfection. You have honed your instincts to give you an edge over your rivals. Your drivers focused, your team ready. The championship in the balance. First past the checkered flag, the goal. Epic victory or ultimate failure. Welcome back Apple Manager family to another Apple Manager video. Today's video we're going to be doing our European Summit Tour event. Now we're going to be doing the opening round. Alright, so we're using Kimi and Alban. As you know, it's an all wet, uh, all dry uh, GP event. So there's no wetness in this one. This is the GP team that we're using. Now, uh, as in, pre in our previous video, if you don't have these exact parts, uh, you can use this one as well. This one will give you uh, top 10 finishes, uh, even if your parts are not. Uh, all maxed out if you're not all maxed out uh, you can definitely be using this one top 10 finishes the only issue is that the pit time is a little bit high uh, but it will get the job done all right all right so let's get back to our GP tune and let's get straight into GPs if you're into F1 Manager content, we do a lot of F1 Manager content here at Game of King. Uh, so feel free to subscribe to the channel, turn on your post notifications so you get notified whenever we do their uh, video or go live. And yeah, remember to leave a like on the video as well. So I'm hoping we can get a nice qualifying and get that good start with both drivers pulling out, securing the one two. Uh, though we're though we're still using the GP strategy, not a control or a finish. We still want to put those good scores in in the early. And then later on down in the day, I can uh, pick my position and finish my qualifiers. Alright, so Kimi got third and Alban slacked off. Got 14. That's alright. Alban will do the work and catch up. Always want to start off with the boost. Kimi should pull ahead and take first place. There he goes. Let's see Alban here pulling up. Get into 11. Cut Kimi down as well. He's created a little bit of distance for himself. So, our main aim now is to focus on Alban and to get him up. And he has proven that he will be driving this GP event. There you can see he's slamming in the back. Giannanti, oh yeah, Skimmy. He's defending uh, his rival Alban. Got around Gio. So Alban has shown that he will be driving this GP to get up uh, in the top 10. So we're conserving for three laps here, and then we're gonna come back into pit in the third. Let's boost Alban by pit, catch some of those who are in pit. There we go, cut him down now, put him to go to pit orders. Now let's see, our rivals AI cars are about to run out of tires. So we can boost Kimi in right about here. And we can also boost Alban in 
right from the same position that we boost Kimi in. So he can uh, catch up with some of those drivers who are have run out of tires going into pit. Alright, so we didn't manage to pull any positions in pit. Uh, we're back in ninth place. Alright. So we're going to boost the fourth lap and cut back down from the fifth. Give Albon an opportunity to overtake some of these drivers. Cut Kimi down there. Alright. Cut Albon down now. As we go for another uh, two laps, come back to pit in the sixth. Once you're doing this exact technique of boosting in the fort, uh, you have to be uh, mindful that you cannot boost until you are at least where that number eight car is going into pit, or else you're gonna run yourself out of tires. As you can see, Alban has made his way up the fort. So you have to let them conserve in four to six. We did a little bit of over boosting, uh, but that's okay. Boost give me into pit now. Let's boost Albon in now. So because we boost in the fort there, uh, we did a bit of over boosting in the fort. That cost us. I uh, to run out of tires before. That's alright. And Albon is now back out into ninth position. With two laps to go, our rival Grosjean will be going to pit. His Albon looks like he's going to run out of tires uh, before the end. So we should get around them fairly easy. Let's go Albon. Now is not the time to get stuck on this McLaren. Get around, yes. <coughs> Alright, so now you can catch up to our rival Albon as he runs out of tires. And then get around Vettel. Make your way to fifth. That would be a nice 45 points. Alright, there he is now out of tires. We should get around fairly easy. Catch up to Sebastian Vettel, get him on the last corner, here we go. Alban slammed in the back of Sebastian Vettel. Alright, so that's 44 points, 43. We'll take it. Alright. 43 for our first race. Let's get straight into our next one. Uh, let me know down in the comments how you guys are doing in your event. As you know, I answer to all my comments. Uh, so even if I don't reply with a message, I reply with a, with a heart. So yeah, leave a comment down below. Qualifiers looks good. Okay. So we got seven and ten. Right, 
that's nice. Alright, so it's it's three to four, so we can boost for it three laps entirely. Uh, so we're gonna use that to our advantage in the middle. Let's get this start. Kimmy trying to push through, make his way through the pack to secure some positions in the top. All right, so he did manage to get any. We're gonna keep that boost for a little bit. And cut down right about here. As you can see, the line, the line has been farmed. Our rival has gone with first base, so there's no way we're catching him back at first base. So what we need now is to conserve for these three laps. And we're good for three. Kimmy and Hamilton. Alright. There we might be uh, going for a trick strategy here. Now to start a boost phase from the six. Nice boost <coughs> in Kimi. Put in that go to pit orders for Alban. Or I might just go for four laps with Alban. Yeah, cancel pit with Alban. Let's go for four laps with Alban so we don't stop. Yeah, he can do it. Our rival didn't expect uh, for us to go to four, four, four laps there, so. Figure he wanted us to stock. So let's boost Kimi now. Let's boost Alban into pit. Should get out right behind Kimi. And in front of our rival. There we go. Keep that boost on Alban. We're gonna come back to pit in the six with boat drivers. Kimi seems to be getting stuck a lot here. Alright, let Alban shoot Kimi if you're gonna be stuck in all over the place. Let's go back to pit with Kimi here. Might have to go back to pit with Alban in the six, in the seven, just so we can uh, make up some extra position. Yep. So these two are gonna go to pit with Kimi. So let's go back around with Alban for one more lap. Come back to pit now in the seventh for Alban. We have to be improvising on the fly. Forty one points so far. Good distance between Alban and the number four car so he could he should be able to get into pit in and out before the number four car comes around. Alright, so AI Albon didn't go, come into pit. There we go. So we should be able to catch AI Albon for the last lap and secure second place with Albon. Kimi's now out of fuel. So that's uh, 42 points. So Albon should be able to catch up. Can get by uh, Alban here. <coughs> yeah, there he goes. That's another 43. So we we'll take that 43. Let's give our rival a well done and a good luck.
So that's uh, called improvising. <laughs> uh, when you don't see something going uh, the way you want it, you have to improvise. And once you know the limit of your drivers, really, uh, improvising is pretty easy. We got nine bucks. The rest is waste. Let's get back to the GP. It's a Red Bull ring. I want to test this. I want to switch this tune up. I switch this tune up a bit here and give the other tune a run since this one doesn't seem to be performing uh, up to scratch. Let's see what this tune can do. Let's go. We have been qualifying poorly with the previous GP tune. So we want to see what this one can do here on the Red Bull Ring. Though the pit time is a bit longer, this tune will force you to uh, push your drivers up uh, in the top five. Now we'll see here uh, where we qualify in a minute. Then we can switch back to the GP tune if it's worse. Nine laps on the Red Bull Ring. All these tracks should have now normal temperatures uh, for this race, for this GP. So no need to worry about uh, any form of uh, elements of weather. All right, so we got fourth and ninth. Arrival got one and three. So though we we have improved. Just a little bit in qualifiers with Alban. We didn't manage to get the top spot. Go, Kimi, pull away, pull away, pull away. There you go. Alright, so Kimi made his way up to third. Let's see if we get Hamilton. Yes, let's put him down now. And Alban. In eighth. So we gain two with Kimi and gain one with Alban. Alright, we're gonna conserve now for four laps. Now four laps doesn't look possible. But we're gonna go for four either way. So we're not gonna be boosting any of our drivers, we're just gonna let them conserve. Alban lost one position. He regains one. We need to pass the finish line at that 50 mark. Yep, there we go. So we are good for four. There goes our rival going into pit. Putting that go to pit orders. Saved a little extra so we can boost right around here into pit. And as you know, the pit time is a bit high on this one, so it should be 2.8 or something like that. There we go, 2.80. And Kimmy is out back in second place. Nice. 274 for Alban. He got out right in front of all those guys in the pit, so that's nice. He's back out in ninth place. Now we're in our boost phase. We're gonna come back in the seventh. So as long as our drivers don't get stuck, we should make up a lot of positions here. Uh, to come back in the seventh. 
arrival. Uh, Kimi is going to go for a one stop. Let's go Albon. Uh, Kimi has got first place secured. Go Albon, go, go, go. Coming back into seven. Uh, let's hope Kimi get out in front of Hamilton. And Albon can catch up. Get out right behind. Now Kimi's not going to get out in front. He's just going to get out right behind as he's stuck coming out of the pits. So we have a good amount of traffic to get through for the last two laps. Uh, to catch first place. We can do it. Go, 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 Kimmy. Come on, don't get stuck on these guys. Now he's out of fuel. So it's up to Albon. <laughs> Arrival is boosting. It's up to Albon. To see if he can get up. There we go. Kimmy got him. And he's going to be out of fuel right on the last here. And yeah. That's a 1 3, so that's uh, 45 points. Or 40, yeah, 40, 46, I believe. Yeah, 46 points. 1 3. Alright, so that's a good race. We're going to be doing one more race. So, 4 3 2 there. If your drivers are doing 2 to 3, uh, you can do the 3 3 3. So, you can serve for the first 3 laps and then you will boost. Now come back to pit in the six and do so finish. All right. All right. So Monaco, let's do our final race here on Monaco. Wait. Want to switch back the tune? So as you can see, this GP tune is also good to use. I still haven't found any tune that uh, on paper look better than this tune. This tune is just overall, on paper, the best GP tune I've ever seen. Uh, without epics, that is. Once your epics are leveled up a bit more, then uh, you can... Uh, Make that tune a little bit better. All right. Alright, so uh, the code word for this video is going to be Summer Tour. Uh, so remember to leave uh, code word Summer Tour down in the comments. So I know that you made it to this portion of the video. Really appreciate you guys for all your support. Yeah, let's go. Qualifiers looks good here on Monaco. Four and six, nice. Alban qualified, out qualified Kimi here, so Alban should be doing good in this race. All right, so here's a trick on Monaco uh, with these level drivers. Once your drivers are at max level, here's a little trick on Monaco. Can cut down right here 
system that your driver is going to conserve and they're going to go for five laps. <laughs> Timmy's upset about Alban out qualifying him so he's pushing uh, to get back in front but we need Alban in front yep we want Timmy behind for his high defense so he'll be able to hold uh, the rest of the pack uh, behind as Alban will be able to push away pull away create a little bit of distance uh, for them to go to pit So if your drivers are not at max level, please do not use this uh, trick strategy to get 5 laps on soft tires. Please do not go with hard tires for the start and get those 5 laps in and those hard tires then you go back to soft tires and boost to the finish. Uh, once you're using those hard tires you can boost from the fourth lap. <clears throat> so once you're in those hard tires, uh, once you pass the fourth lap. Once you're in, start the fourth lap, you can start your boost phase from there, boost into fit, into soft tires, and come back, um, boost to the finish. Alright, so Kimi let one by. It was uh, AI Albon. Alright, so this is the lap where everyone is going to go into pit in the fort. All that's on soft tires should go to pit in the fort lap. We need Alban to pull away, he's slacking off. Ah, man. He's not pulling away, so we have to boost uh, at the peak here when we come back around. So he can make some distance uh, between himself and Kimi. So they don't stock a lot too much. Arrival went for another pair of soft tires, so he will have to go back to pit. Putting those go to pit orders now to soft tires. Now we're gonna get stuck on Hamilton as we boost Alban into pit. As he can just swing around Hamilton, we're going to stop. Should have pushed Kimi in front to prevent this stocking here. Uh, it's not too bad. We had a good distance uh, between drivers, so we only lost one position, two positions. So that stock only cost us two positions. Now we're boosting into the finish. Uh, Kimi regained his position. Let's go Kimi get up back to fifth. Let's go Alban catch up to that Hamilton as he goes into pit. Uh, he should go, to, go into pit now. So I want both drivers to get by him while he's in pit. So we only have our rival AI Alban and AI Max Verstappen to take care of. We get the one two arrival will be going back to pit as well so i want our alban to catch up so he can get by both of them as they go into pit all right so they're not going to go into pit they're running it they should run out of tires eventually or they won't be able to boost ai verstappen and AI Kimi, our rival Kimi, I should say. So, Alban has caught up to our rival Kimi. He's boosting now. If he keeps that boost up, he's gonna run himself out of tires. There goes Alban getting around. Max Verstappen is a little bit of uh, distance away. We have too much traffic, so we're not gonna catch Max Verstappen here. Let's see if Kimi can get around AI Alban here. Take that inside line. Nice. Got him. Alright, so yeah, that was a good race. Well done. Good luck. So that's a trick to get five laps on Monaco. 
to cut the boost from the first corner and let them conserve around for the entire five laps. All right, 44 points. Nice. All right, so remember to leave code word summer tour uh, down below in your comments so I know that you made it to this portion of the video. Really appreciate you guys for your support. And that's going to be it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.